He earned his nickname, Rude, as a youngster. They're from Calvert, Texas. When he beat the great major leaguer, Rude Waddell, in a head-to-head -head matchup, and the nickname stuck. He also had the full repertoire to go along with this unique pitch that he created called back then a fadeaway. And so, yeah, Rube doesn't get nearly enough credit for having been one of the most dominant pitchers in black baseball history. Most of Rube Foster's career was with the Chicago American Giants, but he was a dominant force on the mound even before that. In 1903, Root pitched four Two games balls. for the Cuban no X Christ. Giants against the Philadelphia Giants in a championship series. He went 4-0, all complete games, and gave up just three earned runs. Here's the left fielder, Harvey. Now, this is a pretty incredible stat. In 1905, Root Foster pitched in 55 games. He won 51 of them. Aye. There's a strike. Chris, you were talking last inning about how Rube threw in 55 Aye. games in 1905. So different in today's game. What a starting pitcher can lead the league with about 33 starts. Well, that's and Boo, the what makes it even more amazing is that back then, starters were expected to throw a complete game pretty one much every time out. Teams didn't have a lot of relievers like they do in the modern game, so 55 starts then is more like one 80 ball. or even Two 100 strike. today. Now a screamer into the outfield. Makes the grab on the run. Two down. Got him. And that is that.